Thump chasing monster peacock bass. People always ask me about the peacock bass tackle. I thought it's a good idea to make a video about that too. Let's start with the rods. Maybe what's important about that is like they are short, heavy, that they have a lot of power because it's a really powerful fish, the peacock bass. You're gonna need a lot of power to get the big ones out. A good example, falcon peacock bass cara, specially made for peacock bass. They are like six feet three. That's like the ideal length, I guess. For this rod, for me personally, I'm not that tall for like animating, especially top water baits that you animate like that. Perfect for me. On all those trips that I've already did, I figured out that these are good, but for the really big ones, you're gonna need more powerful rod. If you pull a 20 pounder out of a tree, they won't have enough power. So here's what I'm using. Depths, the huge custom series, XXX heavy, XX heavy and now there's a new model like uh, X Heavy for like the large, large bait. I fish the XXX Heavy rod. Even a 13, 12 pounder sometimes really brings the rod to its limit. But with this thing, you're on the, on the safe side, I would say. If you want to fish like wood choppers, minnows, shark bait, the falcon rods are the real deal, I would say. Or something similar. I would recommend like really short rods. New official rod from Tulala. Japanese brand, a small brand, I guess. They're especially made for peacock bass or exotic fish. It's like just five, nine. So it's really short, but, but it still works. It also has like a lot of power. To come to a point, what's important about the rods that they're short and heavy, like powerful. And of course, it all depends on the lures you're gonna fish. The bigger the lure, the heavier the rod. For well, like chick fishing, for, for chicks, I fish Magicraft bone that's also like Japanese brand. These are also like 6.3 XX heavy now. Like with all Japanese rods, they're a little bit overrated. They don't have that much power compared to like an American brand rod with the same specs. A lot of people I've seen fishing with spinning gear as well. If you like that, okay. I, I personally really don't like that. To everyone, its own thing, I would say. 